Hey everybody, today's video is about should you live together before you get married? Should you, um, some people, I think nowadays more people would say you should definitely live together before you get married. Us, we did not live together before we got married. Um... And it's been working out so far. So I won't say that you should. <laughs> Please. Okay. I wouldn't say that you should. I don't think it's necessary um, for you to have a, um, a successful marriage to live together. Um, the way we were brought up, you know, that was considered shacking. Shacking. You don't shack. <laughs> and um, so yeah, that was absolutely out of the question. And I already I knew for myself that I would I just would stay with my parents until I got married. I never had the um the plan to live on my own. And I knew, like I knew that I knew that I knew that I was gonna get married young. I wanted to like kinda similarly follow in the footsteps of my mother. Uh, my parents, and so my mother got married young. I was like, I'm going to get married young. I'm just going to stay here. You know, I didn't want to live on my own. And so I moved from my parents' house to our home together uh, the day. I think I brought my bags to the house the night before. Yeah. Like the luggage the night before, like the day, the night before we got married, I, it wasn't even like I was setting up shop for months ahead of time. It was the night before, and then, and then we had to hurry. I had to hurry up and leave so you wouldn't see me after. But, but then you didn't midnight. Not, you 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 ended up not going to um not not going back to the house until um until we got back from the mini moon. Oh yeah, That's we had a mini moon. We had a mini moon in the area and. Um, it was a few days even before we went yeah. back to the house. Maybe we were together at the hotel, but you know, we didn't uh, like sleep in our house for a few days after that. So yeah, and <clears throat> um, everything has worked out. I mean, the Juan and I are, have been blessed enough to know each other well prior to getting married and have the opportunity to get to know each other, but right. still... Um, I think there's plenty of space and opportunity to get to know the person that you're intending to marry without living with them. You know, some people say you don't know someone until you live with them. But again, I think if you spend enough time together and so and you get to the point where you have decided that you want to marry this person, you shouldn't now be married and living together and they drop something on the floor and you mad. Like, I mean, say, oh, you know, can you pick that up, please? Or, you know, let the person know how it is now. You can have these discussions even well prior to marriage. You be like, I, I don't like when people do when people do this. So if that person does that, they have an opportunity to kind of figure out how they want to adjust when, um, even if they feel like they have to adjust, they like, listen, we're married, okay? I put my shirts on the floor, just <laughs> whatever. But give that, I mean, that telling somebody, you know, when we move, when we live together, you know, I like this sink or whatever, this side of the bed, whatever the case is, that gives them an opportunity to adjust to knowing what they're getting into. I don't think that you have to live together to, um, before you get married to see if this is going to work out. And that's the same thing for sex, but, you know, that's we can talk about that in another video. But I think that, you know, but just to reiterate, you know, what you said, if if you realize that that person is the person that you want to be with and that, you know, you want to spend the rest of your life with, their habits being at home, whatever those habits are, shouldn't be the deal breaker. Yeah, you know yeah. Like, so... I mean, I don't think it's I don't think it's necessary at all to to live together. But what if what if it's a situation where you know, um, like let's say someone gets a job 
in another state, and the and the, they're not married yet, but they all you know they, they move down there together at the same time. They get a place, they're sharing a place, but they're still you know might be respectful of you know their beliefs and you know may might refrain from having sex or whatever. But they're just they're just living together out of necessity and not just to play house before being married. Like you know, you, you, are, you, are you cool with that? I don't think it's impossible to live together and not have sex. I'm sure people have decided to live together prior to marriage and didn't. They still waited to, to after marriage. Do I think that living together, even though you made that that promise that we're not going to do anything before marriage, I mean... Homie walking around in the middle of the night, no shirt on, sister got on the nighty, you know, it's like, they all right next door, I mean, we all gonna get married next month, so, I mean, it, I mean, but I'm saying, it like, causes, but, 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 I mean, but, 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 I know, none of that completely, I mean, just, 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 just uh, 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 they just roommates, yeah, but, but they have intentions to, to get married, they will get married, but they're literally, like, respecting boundaries and, like, cool, you know, okay. but, just out of necessity. I mean, I suppose it's, it's possible. Um, I mean, did both of them get jobs to move down there? Or if it's just the one? And whatever you want it to be, it's fake. But I it's guess, it's, I know, but I'm just saying, like, I guess in a relationship, you want to be wherever your partner is, wherever um, your significant other is. So that's understandable that one would want to, if they're going to set up shop and live in this particular area, that it's like, okay, why not both of us go down now, I mean, it's, hey, if it works for you, um, and you know that, you know, I'm, this is me just throwing my beliefs in there, you know you're not going to do anything, um, sexually before marriage, and you just strictly want to just get a jump start on this part, um, of your life together, hey. Because, I mean, I, I just... Now, normally, I, you know, of course, we didn't live together, yeah. and I had no intentions of living with her before we got married. Mm -hmm. um, my my focus was, you know, getting us a house because I didn't want to stay in our apartment. Um, I, I just I just wanted a house, for, you know, for my own personal reasons, and that was my goal. And then, you know, we got married and so on and so forth. But um, I do know of situations where it's like if you get the house built. And, you know, it might take X amount of months and the house might be done before you get married. And it's like, well, you know, I mean, sometimes. So like, are the these for like, or, are these like, I know where, you know, the husband can move in um, prior to the wife. Are these instances where people are already established and they may have, have their own home? Because if that's the case for yeah, me, yeah. I would just stay with my parents until the house got built. Or, you know. Yeah, yeah. I mean, but what if it was out of town? You know, you probably wouldn't want to be, you know. Yeah. But I don't know, but my whole thing is I don't think it's a good idea to play house. And that that, that means, you know, everything a husband and wife do without being a husband and wife, that's playing house. But you know, if you can, you know, not play house if some some people's circumstances could be like, you know, mm -hmm. yeah, we, 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 we live together. I mean I, I just, like but I, was, but I, I, I wouldn't want that personally, though. Yeah. So. I mean, like I said, I think nowadays people are like, no, you better, you better know that person. You better know for sure. And it, it, to me, I think it goes the extra mile when you, when you go through whatever and you are able to make that decision outside of living together. It seems like. Um, it takes more of an effort. Like, I don't know how to, I don't know how to explain it. I, I don't, like, living together, it kind of can, I don't know. So, what if, what if, like, even, even going further than living together, let's say, you know, you together, you live together, you you know, whole nine yards, and then you realize, <laughs> ah, you know, homie, 
homie, exactly. you know, and then was exactly. out of there, you know, one and then out, like, <laughs> what, you know, like, you are so extra, <laughs> but I'm saying though, what if, what, what if that happens and then like, the girl like, so now you're stuck in this house that y'all done got, and homie or homegirl, because some people be like, you know, they want, they want to test it out, you yeah, know, you test drive like, a car yeah, before yeah, you buy it. it. That, yeah, that goes back to like if you put the work in and you learn each other outside of because you can get comfortable. I mean, I, I know you're gonna live together every day after you get married, but beforehand, before you have before you have that like that bond, yeah, um, and you live together, you can get comfortable and not even kind of like um make any effort towards still learning the person like it's just it's another it's person that lived in whatever sure. but if um, you mm -hmm. in, in my mind yeah when we got married it was just like like e even if you were just like hey you know i want to move in early you know whatever I still would have been like. Parents wouldn't go for that. <laughs> well, we're, 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 I mean, I know that. I'm just thinking but, outside. I'm but just thinking I'm, I'm, outside. I'm just saying because, like, like in, in my mind, it was like once we got married, it was like, like from that line on, this is our life. Us. But if you would have moved in like a couple months before, it's kind of like, well, we was already, you know, living together, yeah. you know, whatever. But it's mm -hmm. like now it's just a piece of paper. But it was like, no, literally, when your father, you know, placed you in my hands. From that day, from that moment on, you know, you know that starts the journey. Praise I didn't, Lord. I didn't want the journey to start, you know. Praise you know, Lord. but, but, that, but good. back to my previous comment though. So, what do you say to the young lady who, you know, her, she, and homie doing anything, and she realized that he, you know, not uh, what she wants. He, he um. You can figure out how to. I mean, I don't know. But what, 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 every, every, everything about them is greatness and this, and you know they live in a lifestyle where you know they handling business, and she found out. You know, she she finds out like man, homie. You know like. <laughs> Are you meaning like whether she should exit the relationship or what is she to do with the, this house that they now have together? I mean, I mean well, let's say that, that they live together. It's not necessarily saying that, that they purchased a the house. Oh, okay, like okay. So it might not be like like a financial okay. commitment. But well, isn't that just like a breakup? So, but but, but I'm saying though, be, because you get down with the get down. Yeah. You know, well, but I guess you don't want to find out on your wedding night either. I don't know, but. <laughs> Listen, I you can. <laughs> Why are you so funny? But like, <laughs> I, I, I don't, I don't know. But I think, me personally, I think it's better to experience that uh, with your wife, with your wife. Uh, but you know, people, people do them. You know. Yes, so. you should. Are we talking about? Are we talking about living together? Are we talking about? I'm, I'm everywhere. I don't, I'm everywhere. I'm everywhere. If we talking about something up, like that goes, this goes across the whole board. Marriage, okay. It's a structure where you do things, let's just say it's a bubble. You do things inside of this bubble and it makes for, it can make for a, even a better relationship when you do these things together, like living together inside that marriage bubble because and I'm just going to speak from an optimistic standpoint where your marriage is going to work out I'm not mm -hmm. I'm not going to factor in divorce or anything like that I'm just saying like if you live together prior to marriage what is keeping you here what is what is keeping you committed to staying in this house like it's it doesn't seem like it's anything. Now I know though there are some people who live together, they have no intentions on getting married. They're just like so we don't need to be married. But I'm just saying inside this thing called marriage, 
it's for it's for it's for living together it's for uh sex with your a husband and wife um we can have you know add children in there it's just things that just seem to work better or in in our case um when it's done within these confines and when you do things out before this time it's like what for? And I know there are people who completely disagree because they're like, no, 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 no. Yeah, I'm, I'm sure. But I'm, sure people disagree. I'm just saying, if you put that put that work in, not the sexual kids part, but the living together part, um, you put that work in to know that this person is going to be my forever. I, I mean, just at that point, then get married and live together, like. I don't understand what, I mean... So, so... Why do you feel like you need to live together? Just get married then. Let me let me ask you this. Do you think that... If... If a couple lives together... Do you think that that lessens... The chance of them getting married? For some people, yes. That's like how some if, people if, be, if, if, be if, together if for 11 it. years. <laughs> and then yeah. like... Yeah. Why don't you let, you know? Yeah, because I mean, I, I, I feel like if you, uh, again, if you plan a Murray role, you you cooking and cleaning and, yeah. you know. What would even make know? him yeah, like, what's the marry point? you if he's getting wifely duties before, right. you know. And if he's not married, he can walk away now. He don't have to worry about, point. you know, some type of lawyers. Then you're going to be stuck washing the dishes. Stuff. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you know. Mm-hmm. Thank you for always washing the dishes. You are so kind. I try my best. Try you do an best. excellent job. I really appreciate that. I try my best. But just, I don't think that, I, I think that marriage is meant for some things. And like living together is one of them. I mean, you get to know, of course, your significant other prior to marriage. Mm. But then once that, union comes together it just it, it just grows deeper like getting to know the person on, on on deeper levels by being together 24 7 all day every day um some people may not like that either they may not go for the for the for the velcro look but <laughs> hey, i mean maybe that's another video we can make yeah um <laughs> but Again, guys, you know, this is just our perspective. This is just us, yeah. This is what we did. Um, we didn't live together, like we said, and it's it's amazing. So you don't feel like you have to live yeah, together, yeah. I don't you know. Yeah, know that you have to. Or you, you hear somebody saying, no, you need to live with them before you. Yeah. Now you hear somebody saying, you don't yeah, have you to. Know, you don't have to. You know and it, it works. I think if you work to learn the person, um... I mean, I don't know if everyone watching this video is um, Christian or whatever, whatever have you. Uh, but you work to know the person and you ask for guidance and wisdom on, you know, how to strengthen and keep your relationship together. But again, this is our perspective. If you guys have a different perspective... And if you feel like you should yeah. live together or, or before if, you get married, you please explain a story, it to us. A story yeah. about how, how you guys working out living together, mm-hmm. whatever, let us know. Yeah, leave a comment. Leave um, a comment. We'll definitely comment back and we can start a dialogue on... Yeah, because th- this is just our just, Yeah, just show us the other side because we yeah. were both raised similarly. And so we kind of just meshed and gelled together very well it wasn't like we had to bring together two different backgrounds and figure it out and make it work we just it was just a natural progression for us so if you find that this side is complete baloney and you're like no you should live together let me tell you why please tell me why tell me why i am listening tell me why but uh thanks for watching And we'll catch y'all in the next one. Have a beautiful day.